Some of the region's brightest and youngest minds put their innovations on display this afternoon. Local 12's Brad Underwood takes us to the Invention Convention. It works for tennis balls, wiffle balls, and baseballs. Nine-year-old Gus Kleinfeld has the perfect way to pick up his toys. It's called the GK Baseball Picker Upper. All you have to do, press down, but it will, and it picks them up. And Gus wasn't the only person who thought it was a good idea. So did the judges. 11-year-old Yashmit Despande was also a winner. The Y-Alert bumper display system is not only innovative, but could actually save lives on the road. Say that I'm driving and suddenly I spot a deer on the side of the road. I will be able to notice and tell other drivers safely that there's a deer on the side of the road because you never know that that deer might actually come onto the middle of the road and the car behind you might even crash because of that deer. And because you're behind the wheel, the notification is voice activated. Medical emergency. And, and whatever I say will then get displayed over here. It pops here. right up there. Yeah, so imagine this as the bumper of my car, and that would just display it for other drivers to see. To get to this convention, these more than 150 kids have already won prizes for their inventions, many of them just clever creations. Some actually solve problems, like the Fire Melter 2000. This invention, it melts snow around fire hydrants in a three-foot radius using solar power so that in the event that it's covered in snow, the fire department can find it. And for his idea, Ryan Martz took home first place in his grade division. Currently, there are three regional divisions in Ohio for the invention convention, but that could soon change. We're hoping within three to five years this could be a statewide competition where the winners from the regions go to the state and then the state picks the overall winner. Various prizes, including college scholarships, were awarded to the top inventors. At Union Terminal, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. What an impressive group of kids. More than $650,000 in scholarship money has been awarded since the invention convention began in 1993.